Good day children. This is teacher Shilpa Adkar. Let us learn summary writing, one of the writing skills in English. Summary writing. A summary gives the main points of a passage in brief. It does not give details or examples and is generally written in one paragraph. You are expected to summarize the passage given for comprehension into approximately one third of its total length. Count the number of words in the question passage and divide it by three while writing the summary. Some rules to be followed. Read the passage given for comprehension carefully and understand it. You have to read the passage at least twice. You are expected to give the main ideas of the passage. Please write the summary in one paragraph only. Please remember children, you have to write this in one paragraph only. Even if the question comprehension has two paragraphs, the summary will be written only in one paragraph. Underline those sentences you think are important in the question passage. So what will happen is you will know what are the main ideas that you have to put in include in the summary. Leave out all statistics, dates and names, quotations, details and comparisons unless they are important for the understanding of the text. Stick to the ideas in the passage. Do not change the meaning of the original. Change direct speech into indirect speech where necessary. Whatever is there in direct speech, you have to give it in reported speech. Avoid using exact words or phrases from the passage. The summary should be in your own words. But you have to avoid giving your own opinion. The ideas should be the facts which are given in the comprehension passage. You cannot give your own opinion. And lastly, give, a summary, give the summary a suitable title. The marking scheme for summary writing. Title consists of one mark. For the central idea or theme, you get two marks and for use of appropriate language, it's two marks. So totally summary writing has three marks, uh, sorry, five marks. This is the first comprehension passage. Write a summary of the passage for comprehension given below, such as a suitable title. Children, please pause the video over here and read the comprehension passage at least twice. Try to write the summary on your own. Now what you have to do is, as given in the rules, you will count the number of words which is there, uh, that are there in this passage. You will divide it by three and approximately that many words should be there in your summary. This is the answer for the first passage given. There is a title also, Issues Concerning Women. And if you see, the summary which is given over here is approximately one third of the question passage. This is the second example of summary writing. The rules remain the same. Pause the video over here. Read the passage twice and try to write the summary on your own and compare it with the answer that is given below.
this is the answer of the second comprehension passage the title height of stupidity the title is very important this is also approximately one third of the second passage I hope you have understood summary writing. Thank you.